guys, back again with another video and we're going straight back into fan art February. If you can't see the pattern by now, I know I don't upload every day so it's a little bit difficult. I'm trying to do traditional work than digital work and my traditional work is usually like a show or something I'm a fan of and then my digital work is usually YouTubers. So I'm trying to mix and match and have one and then the other. So today's video is dedicated to Tessa Violet. If you don't know who Tessa Violet is, I'll link her down below. But again, she's a big YouTuber. She started off here on YouTube as Mika Kitty, I believe. I followed her back then when she used to dance to songs and stuff and I just loved her personality I suppose. She was just a cool person. Right now some of her songs I'm addicted to uh, just off the top of my head. Not Over You and Sorry I'm Not Sorry. I find myself singing them randomly just randomly around the house so go check them out and she has some of the most amazing hairstyles and hair colours you will ever come across. Like I wish I could just get up and do my hair the way she does it because it, she makes it seem so effortless. Like, she puts her hair up into a pony and it looks amazing whereas mine doesn't <laughs> so yeah, uh, this video is for Tessa and and I done it with Paint Tool Say. So it's digital work and I really really love the style of this. Um, I feel like I'm getting a little bit more comfortable with my tablet now that I'm starting to use it again. I'm trying to use it regularly but also keep my traditional work in there and I do find that if I use my tablet too much my traditional work suffers and vice versa. Yeah, vice versa. They're definitely both skills that I want to keep in my repertoire. <laughs> definitely though I can see my Myself improving it's slow but you gotta practice to make progress I really really like how her hair turned out in this I don't know if you guys do but I think it's it's amazing and I love the little ears again something I'm gonna be incorporating a lot more because I love the floating head thing that's something I came across in college I decided that my characters just weren't gonna have necks anymore <laughs> so that's something I do a lot and um, I love just the dot eyes and the mouth really far up that's also something I think I came across that just after college I decided I like that. Oh, the noodle arms. I came across them in college as well. And then now, those little ears. Those little ears are so cute. So definitely something I'm going to be incorporating. Uh, I think next I'll have to find a proper nose because it's just a little line. Or sometimes, most of the time, not a nose at all. So let me know what you think of this. Also, I think this is my first time drawing a guitar. I'm not sure, but I think it is. So, I mean, it turned out okay. <laughs> she plays the guitar. I think she taught herself how to play the guitar. Not sure. She definitely plays the guitar. So if Tess is use this. I hope you like it. I love your music and you're a cool person. And let me know what you think of this guys and I'll be back again in two days with another Fan Art February video. Hope you have a great day.